Hi there, welcome to another video of WP Expo. In this video, I'm going to show how to display WordPress subcategories on their category pages. It will attract your readers to explore the subcategory pages. As a result, they'll stay on your site for a longer period. You can also do it with the help of the PostX plugin. So, after installing and activating PostX, you need to enable its dynamic site builder add-on, which allows us to create dynamic templates for all essential pages. Moreover, you need to enable the taxonomy add-on. It helps to add the featured images and specific colors for your desired taxonomies. After enabling the add-on, you need to go to its settings section. From here, you can select which type of taxonomies you want to add images and colors to. For now, I'm selecting only categories. However, you can also select tags or any other custom taxonomies. Now, let's go to the category section and start editing a subcategory. Here, you can see that we can add an image and color for this subcategory. Similarly, we can add images and colors to all subcategories and categories as well. Then, we need to create a custom category page template. For that, we need to go to the Site Builder section of PostX and click on the Category option. We can either start from scratch or choose a pre-made template from the available options. For now, let's import a pre-made template. Then, we need to decide and select which category page we want to use a template for. For now, let's keep it as it is. However, you can also create a template for specific categories. Now, we need to add the taxonomy block to our desired position. The default view is not good, but don't worry. We can customize it to improve the appearance. We can customize each of the elements of the taxonomy block from its settings section. However, instead of manual customization, we can select any of the layout variations or import one from its design library. Now, as we want to display only the subcategories, we need to use the taxonomy query setting. It allows us to sort the categories and subcategories of the taxonomy block. We are selecting the immediate child archive option from the query type. So, when someone visits a category page, they will see its child or subcategories. At last, we can publish the template and see how it looks on the front end. Here, you can see that we are in the fashion category page, and the subcategories are now visible. Similarly, if we can go to any other category page, for example, food, we only see the child categories of the parent category. So, that's all from this video. You can learn more about displaying subcategories from the blog post. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more effective WordPress and WooCommerce videos.